Welcome to the course Practical Convolutional Neural Networks by Pact Publishing. The authors of this course are Mohit Sevak, Mohammad Rezaul Karim, and Pradeep Pajari. I am Todd Heppenstall, and I will be the voiceover artist for this course. First, a few words about the authors. Mohit Sevak is an artificial intelligence scientist with extensive experience and technical leadership in the research, architecture and solutioning of artificial intelligence-driven cognitive and automation products and platform for industries like IoT, retail, BFSI and cybersecurity. In his current role at QIO Technologies, Mohit is leading the Reinforcement Learning Initiative for Industry 4.0 and Smart IoT. Mohamed Rizal Karim is a research scientist at Fraunhofer FIT in Germany. He is also a PhD candidate at RWTH Aachen University in Germany. Before joining FIT, he worked as a researcher at the Insight Center for Data Analytics in Ireland. He was a lead engineer at Samsung Electronics in Korea. He has nine years of R&D experience with C++, Java, R, Scala and Python. He has published research papers on bioinformatics, big data, and deep learning. He has practical working experience with Spark, Zeppelin, Hadoop, Keras, Scikit-Learn, TensorFlow, Deep Learning 4J, MXNet, and H2O. Pradeep Pajari is machine learning engineer at Walmart Labs and a distinguished member of ACM. His core domain expertise is in information retrieval, machine learning, and natural language processing. In his free time, he loves exploring AI technologies, reading, and mentoring. This course starts with an overview of deep neural networks, with an example of image classification, and walks you through building your first CNN model. You will learn concepts such as transfer learning and autoencoders with CNN that will enable you to build very powerful models, even with limited supervised labeled image training data. The first section, Deep Neural Networks, Overview, gives a quick refresher of the science of deep neural networks and different frameworks that can be used to implement such networks, with the mathematics behind them. After that, Introduction to Convolutional Neural Networks introduces the viewers to convolutional neural networks and shows how deep learning can be used to extract insights from images. The third section, Build Your First CNN and Performance Optimization, constructs a simple CNN model for image classification from scratch and explains how to tune hyperparameters and optimize training time and performance of CNNs for improved efficiency and accuracy, respectively. It also shows the advantages and working of different popular and award-winning CNN architectures, how they differ from each other and how to use them. The following section, Transfer Learning, teaches you to take an existing pre-trained network and adapt it to a new and different dataset. There is also a custom classification problem for a real-life application using a technique called transfer learning. The next section, Autoencoders for CNN, introduces an unsupervised learning technique called autoencoders. We walk through different applications of autoencoders for CNN, such as image compression. Then, Object Detection and Instant Segmentation with CNN teaches the difference between object detection, instant segmentation, and image classification. We then learn multiple techniques for object detection and instant segmentation with CNNs. We also explore generative CNN networks, and then we combine them with our learned discriminative CNN networks to create new images with CNN and GAN. The final section, Attention Mechanism for CNN and Visual Models, teaches the intuition behind attention in deep learning and learns how attention-based models are used to implement some advanced solutions, image captioning and RAM. We also understand the role of reinforcement learning with respect to the hard attention mechanism. By the end of this course, you should be ready to implement advanced, effective and efficient CNN models in your professional projects or personal initiatives while working on complex images and video datasets. We have used Python version 3.6.4 to build various applications and the open source and enterprise-ready professional software using Python, Spider, Anaconda and PyCharm. Many of the examples are also compatible with Python 3x, as a good practice, we encourage users to use Python virtual environments for implementing these codes. So you need just that. Now that you have a glimpse of what's awaiting for you, 
Let's get started.